Hi. Um, this, once again, is Glenn. I uh, haven't done a video in a while, but I have been working on a few. Anyways, I just, uh, before I begin, my little cup of coffee. Mmm. Nothing like fresh coffee. Yum. Anyways, I have uh, two hundred, sorry, I have two 175 watt uh, wind turbines from Rustic Power. And uh, this guy really makes a great product. I just love it. And I'm going to unbox these two you know, for everyone's pleasure. Now, this guy makes, uh, a as he says, wind turbines that people can afford. Um, unless you have a lot of wind, they don't produce a lot, but as he says, it will help you see if you want to put out the big bucks for a larger unit. And if you have a lot of wind, like in like places in New Mexico, or uh, southern Alberta, Lethbridge, you know, places with more constant wind, then these things, absolutely great, no problems. Anyways, let's get to the um, unpacking. Okay, first things first. Now, let's see what we find. we find that I haven't cut all the tape. <laughs> I believe these are the tail parts. Well, two, oh. the instructions I know, every guy in the world is looking and saying, instructions, what are those? <laughs> it's okay, I do that too. One of, one of the units, another one of the units, I believe these are the, uh, you know, holder for the blades, the, uh, Hub. Are they called blades or sails? I don't know. Anyways, the second hub for the blades, sails, wings, whatever. Now, these parts are because it's longer, so it had, well, they're parts. We'll see. It's a big mystery. And two sets of blades. Because, of course, I have two units. There. Now, let's take a look and see what they look like. By the way, this is one of those lifetime guarantee scissors I got in a food slicer. It came broken, so I'll have to get a new one. Or is the guarantee it? Perhaps it's a guarantee. It's a lifetime guarantee for the life of the scissors. <laughs> there, this is. Pretty robust unit. Okay, this is the front part. I believe there's a rear part that goes on that has the tail about here, I think. A matter of fact, let's take a look in one of those and see 
if I be right. Take a look at the hub that you get. Oh yes, this fellow is now selling what he calls enhanced units, uh, which means basically when the blades are turning slowly, not enough to produce uh, 12 volts, but turning slowly, uh, he has a capacitor which holds energy, and then when it gets enough voltage stored up, it shoots it out to the batteries, which is really a brilliant innovation. It's wonderful and uh, just it's a testament to um, backyard inventors and how the internet has you know, brought us together and spurred all of us on to uh, doing amazing things. Anyways, I'll stop yammering for a moment and uh, um, show you the hub. Here we are. Has places for six blades. Now, let's let's take a look at one of the tails. the tail. So we have all of our parts and putting together I'll do on a different video because I'm definitely definitely going to be ordering more from this fellow. I like the units that he builds. It's wonderful. Now I am working on my own innovation because he doesn't have any furling mechanisms on these, you know, like in really high winds to turn the blades away so they don't, you know, you know. but um, I have a very simple uh, thing I'm going to try and uh, if it works and auto furls at, you know, high speed and saves these things, then I'll let everybody know. If not, you can look at the video of my mistake and uh, laugh because <laughs> God knows my family will. <laughs> Anyways, that's my unboxing of of one of my two uh, new wind turbines from Rustic Power. Anyways, uh, enjoy and remember uh, power really is a precious resource and I believe it is artificially cheap. One day people might, the, the, the truth might come out because if you have solar panels or wind or even a generator, I'm sure you realize that power, you know, it takes a lot to make power. Uh, it takes a lot more than just plugging into the grid. Uh, power is a precious and limited resource. Well, it's unlimited, but um, limited in the sense that when you plug in, you know, there's only so much that they'll make, I guess. But, you know, if you order wind turbines and solar panels, then it can be less limited, but still extremely expensive and um, sometimes difficult to produce. And then there's the whole story of boat, uh, boat uh, storage, like with batteries. Uh, but that is a uh, rant for another video. Anyways, I'm going to go and put my uh, wind turbine up and because there's no wind, 
just uh, stare at it and go, please turn. <laughs> Anyways, have a great day. Uh, invent, innovate, have fun, and um, I'll see everybody later.